Remember, Fest Pack is going on all through the weekend and through the 16th, and some festivities tonight, including at the Kalihi Palama Settlement. And joining us to tell us more is its executive director, Sam Ayona. Good to see you. Thank you, Annalisa. Where's the Puligi? Oh, I saw the last segment. <laughs> <laughs> it's upstairs. I'll bring it all for you okay, later on. Thank yeah. you. Thank you. Uh, yeah, Talofa, as <laughs> they, they told us uh, earlier. So tell us about Palama Settlement, because this is historical. There's significance to bringing Fest yes. Pack to your yes. location. So, Palama Settlement, <clears throat> you know, we're 100. 27 year old organization. A lot of the immigrant groups came to, when they came to Hawaii, they kind of settled at, in the Kalihi Palama area and at Palama Settlement. And so for us, it's special to have Fest back at Palama Settlement because, you know, all, all these different ethnic groups are coming here to perform. And I tell you, Annalisa, last night, it was, it was incredible. It was special. I mean, we hear about Fest Pack and, you know, what Fest Pack means is all these Pacific nations coming together. And then when you see it, when you see the performances and see people, all coming together to celebrate the Pacific Islands. You know, it's it was awesome. It was an incredible night. Yeah, so you night. had last night, yep. and then you had tonight also. Yes. So who's so, going to be performing today? So tonight it's uh, Western Samoa, Kiribati, uh, uh, Aotearoa. It will be there. Marshall, the Marshall, uh, um, Marshallese will be there doing their performances as well. And so, you know, Paloma Salmin, the, the community, you know, Primarily right now, we do have a lot of Micronesians and uh, Marshallese in the area. So for them, last night when the Federated States of Micronesia was performing, people were really into it, you know, and that was really special for me because this is our community and it was their culture, it was their islands performing, and it was, it was incredible to see that energy and pride. And so tonight, Five o'clock it starts. It's supposed to go till nine, but I think it's going to go a little bit later. And, and that's it's great, you know, to see that. Uh, bring your lawn chair, bring your mats. You know, sit down on the great lawn. It was we've got food vendors like uh, from scratch. They'll be there tonight. Uh, I guess I'll get my puligi tonight. Yeah, there. you get. They'll, I'll they'll get hook my, you uh, up, I think, tonight. Sam. <laughs> uh, so we, we have food vendors. We have crafts there. You know, it's great. It's, it's, I encourage everybody to please come down tonight. It'll yeah, be awesome. We always talk about, you know, the Hawaii Convention Center with the yes. Festival Village and yeah. all these other, you know, big locations like yeah. the Polynesian Cultural Center. Yeah. But I think what makes your location unique is you do have the free parking and free it's parking. easier to get there. <laughs> yes. Yeah. And, and the history of, you know, Paloma Settlement and just being in that area. So, uh, yeah, you know, I, I go to the Convention Center, check out the exhibits, check out the, uh, you know, what they have there and then come to Paloma Settlement and actually watch the performances mm -hmm. tonight from 5 to 10. We We'd love to have people come down. It was, you know, uh, like I said, a really special evening last night. And, and I was talking with somebody from uh, Pompeii. And I said, hey, the buses are here. And he goes, we, we didn't come to go on the buses. We came here to watch our brothers and sisters from Wallace and Futuna. I don't even know what Wallace, I had to look it up. It's, it's you know, a territory in, near Fiji. And so mm -hmm. Wallace and Futuna was performing. And he said, uh, uh, Emerson from the Pompeii said, this, we are all connected by the blue Pacific Ocean. And I was like, wow. Yeah. You put it poignantly for me is that uh, Palama Settlement is almost like an Ellis Island. It is. It's like the Ellis Island of the Pacific. Everyone, every immigrant group that first came to Hawaii, when they first came here, they you know, was in the Kalihi Palama area. Palama Settlement welcomed them. And, you know, so today, the, in our it's latest. Like homecoming. It is. It is. And for people that, from all these different ethnicities, you know, to come there and watch these performances from their you know, uh, uh, from their cultures and for their perspective, it was it was really really uh, great. And so, uh, yeah. you know, I'm glad that uh, you know Aaron and uh, Makanani Salah selected Palama Settlement as one of their sites. They've been doing a great job. It's a great relationship we have, and Festback is going well. So, you know, you go to the Mary Monarch Festival, you you watch it on TV. It's, it, Stan Sheriff, it was a great evening. You know, people saw it, but to be there, Annalisa, and the to energy. see the energy, yeah. you got to come it down. Amazing. It was like a huge family gathering. I it think was. that's what everyone always says. A huge ohana of the Pacific. It was. It was. So, Sam, thank you so much for joining us. We'll have to do more stories about the amazing history yes, of Palama thank Settlement. You. Thank Sam you. Iona there.